And we welcome our next guest who spent the majority of his career playing a Wookiee, turning the lovable sidekick into one of the most beloved characters in film history. We are excited to have the Chewbacca himself, Peter Mayhew, joining us this morning. Good morning to you. Good morning. How are you? Oh, we're doing wonderful, and this is a great weekend, and welcome yes. back to Calgary. Yes, it's been a long time. A it's long time. Eleven years. Eleven years. Now you were actually at the very first expo. Yes. And what have you have you noticed how things have evolved and changed? Things have got bigger and better. Yes. There's more organization and it seems to be working very well because we get a lot more people through. Yeah, about 100,000 uh, Calgarians and visitors expected oh, wow. to be here over the weekend uh, to see people like yourself. Yeah, we can count them all. <laughs> and actually, we should sort of state the obvious here in that uh, you played Chewbacca and the casting was obvious uh, due to the fact that you were seven foot three, yeah, uh, very tall. And uh, I understand uh, your hand size is also quite outstanding, which well, we can let's do a little one. comparison here. Oh my goodness. It's double the size of my hand. Double the size. Wow. Wow. That is outstanding. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. Uh, tell us a little bit about what it means to you to be able to have the chance to meet these fans. Of course, Star Wars is, is well loved by so many, but for you to have the opportunity to meet your fans. It, it's one of those th situations that you are now dealing with four generations. Mm. So you get grandmas, parents, kids, and babies. Yes. So you get the whole situation right across the board. And everybody, you know, everybody knows Star Wars. Mm -hmm. But the main thing is everybody know, also knows 3PO, R2, and Chewie. Yes. Those are the three ones that people look at. You know, they come up to the table and they look at it, look at it, and go, "Hmm, there's Chewy," and these are four and five years old. Oh my goodness! Absolutely wonderful. There he is. There he is. Yay! And the character that you've uh, lived with for so many years and uh, had the opportunity to play, and what. What a beautiful gift. I imagine when you were cast in this role, did you have any idea how the, the, this would go, the trajectory of no. your life? Yeah. What we were told at the interview was that it's a possibility, it's a sci fi movie mm. that, had, that was a B movie. Consequently, who knew that this was going to turn into a piece of history? Yes. It was just, you know, it's just amazing. There he is, getting his Lifetime Achievement Award. <laughs> yeah. Yay. Chewbacca <laughs> deserved that medal. He did. He didn't get one on the first day, but we got one eventually. So it made it all the, dip, all the better. Mm. Really nice. And now I know these movies, uh, of course, are, are well protected, of course, and that uh, fans have a great appetite for knowing what goes on. But can you speak a little bit to uh, reuniting with the cast and coming back to set? Does it feel like a family? Very much so, yes. Because when you're, you know, when you do the first one, mm -hmm. you all come together. Yeah. Right. You do that. You go away. Then. They decided to do Empire, and it was like coming back from, or coming back to college after leaving. Right. You all knew who you, where you were, and I don't know. There's just a, there's a mixture of wonderful people yeah. that are involved. Carrie, Mark, Harrison, of course, yes. which I had, I had, oh, I hadn't seen for some time, mm. and it was. It was just nice to be around. Yeah, and to be a part of. Be a part of it, and knowing that I will never ever have to do another interview for <laughs> a job. You That's know, right. Three is there. I don't have to do it. Uh, I don't have to worry about it because even you know over a period of time. You get producers, directors, mm. all coming up saying, "Oh, I've got this movie, blah 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 blah." And okay, let's have a look at it. Let's yes. see what it is. Yes. If you like it, you do it. If not, 
Thank you. There's always not a, not a person down the road. That's not a bad Thank not you. a bad gig to have at all. I like it. I like it. And now, can you speak a little bit to the evolution of the character and how uh, Chewbacca began, and now the process in in the preparation of getting into character has changed dramatically? Um, yes. We looked when we did the interview with George. We had a storyboard, like sort of about the length of that mm. wall. And all the characters were there. And one end, in the middle, you had the f five main characters. One end, you had Darth Vader. Yes. The other end was the walking carpet, as Carrie used to call me. <laughs> because um, it was eight foot, plus blue eyes. George walked up, he said, this is a character we want you to portray. And one good thing, it, you play it, it, we want to play it so that it's almost a mime character. Ah. Therefore, you have to use your head, your bones, the whole body, and even your eyes and ears. So we're going to have to design a costume to, to be able to do all that and still have that. The eyes. The eye, it's the eyes and the, and the head movements that make that character up. And he, you know, obviously, when you're in, when you're on set, you learn what people are taught. You had my my biggest thing was I had to learn what the last words of any script that were uh, that was directed to either me or anybody else, mm. so that I knew what I what I when I came uh, if, if if there was a reference to Chewie. Chewie had to be there on time yes. and put it, <laughs> that kind of thing. Uh, so it was, as I say, it, it, virtually, um, it virtually came out of a, of, of a costume and a mm. character. Mm. And we totally, total success. Total success and yep. lives with us. And in the hearts of many, you are here for the Calgary Comic and Entertainment yep. Expo, the 11th annual, uh, making a comeback here at the BMO Center today through to Sunday. Peter Mayhew, thank you so much for joining us this thank morning you. and continued success. And we hope you enjoy your weekend here in our fine city. Thank you very much. Thank we'll you. Be. Thank you.